PFO friends, thank you for partnering with us in 2013 to help meet the needs of over 600 orphans in China, Kenya, and Thailand. Here is a look at how your gifts were used. As you listen, remember that the Bible calls this effort pure religion and that these little ones are at the forefront of God's heart. I am convinced that He smiles at our efforts and I hope it makes you smile too. Thank you. $10,000 was sent to China. Chen Ling Wai is a precious little girl who recently arrived at New Hope Foundation, PFO's partner medical center for orphans in China. Chen was in the care of a state-run orphanage in China. When it was discovered that she needed medical attention, her caregivers contacted New Hope Foundation to request help on her behalf. When I asked Dr. Joyce, the founder, about their current needs, she asked if we could fund heart surgery for this little girl. I am so happy to tell all of you, PFO friends, that you completely funded Chen Ling Wai's heart surgery in September. Your portions together have given her life. $10,000 was also sent to New Life Kenya, a medical orphanage based in Nairobi that has taken in over 2,000 abandoned infants. Over 80% of the children are then adopted out. Our funds provide for the immediate life-sustaining needs of these infants upon arrival. 30% of the funding for New Life Homes comes from visitors to Nairobi who spend a day or two volunteering at New Life. There won't be many tourists in the coming months as a result of the recent attacks on the Westgate Mall. Our funds were on their way to New Life just as the attacks began. What happened is terrible, but it is wonderful that we as a group can help offset the ripple effects. Belinda arrived at New Life Kenya in February of 2013 when she was nine months old, after being abandoned by her mom. She was neglected, severely malnourished, her skin paper thin, and her skeleton clearly visible. New Life has been feeding her on demand with a high energy baby formula. They are confident that this strong and determined little girl will grow and develop into a healthy and beautiful toddler. Also in February, Harriet Tumaini was brought to New Life at approximately two days old after having been discovered abandoned in a sugarcane field on the outskirts of Kibera slum. Harriet weighed five and a half pounds and was carefully wrapped up in a warm blanket with a black string tied around her umbilical cord stump, which is indicative of a home birth. This beautiful set of twins was born in September 2013. They arrived at New Life Kenya wrapped together in a blanket. Sadly, their birth mother is in a coma at Kenyatta Hospital and the babies have no other relative able to care for them. Both mother and babies are HIV positive. Lana is cup feeding as she was unable to tolerate a nasogastric tube. Connor, Connor has a nasogastric tube and is more alert than his sleepy sister. Both babies will be in incubators until they reach five and a half pounds. They're doing well. Mercy International is the umbrella organization that we partner with in Thailand. They are currently building a third children's village in Northeast Thailand, which will be home to 60 of the children that they oversee. These children range in age from 5 to 18. PFO has recently contributed $6,000 to furnish the new dining room that you see in this new village. PFO has also sent $4,000 to construct a piggery at Mercy's main children's village in Pechabun, Thailand. The pigs have been donated by a couple in Australia. This is a duly beneficial project that will be run by the high school vocational program at the village school that is run by Mercy. The program will be used to provide pork for all of the children who attend the school, including the orphans, each of whom will also be trained on how the program works as they get old enough. Again, thank you all for setting aside a portion for orphans. If you would like more information, to sign up for periodic updates, or to make a gift, please visit portionfororphans.org.